What's going on YouTube? Geosnow right here. So in today's video I'm going to show you how to unlock an iPhone, iPad or iPod Touch if you forgot the passcode for that device. And for that we're going to use a software called iMyPhone Lock Wiper. This software has multiple options in here including Apple ID, Bypass MDM, Screen Time Passcode if you forgot it and even the Screen Passcode over here. We're going to use this option today but you can find more information about how to use for example the MDM stuff over here on their website. They do have pretty long articles about how to use this program and what you can use it for and stuff like that. So definitely check the program out in the link below. The software is available on the imiphone.com website and there is a free trial available for both Windows and Mac OS. It basically supports iOS 16 as well so you can use this for MDM if you forgot your Apple ID, if you forgot your passcode and stuff like that. So let's go ahead and see how you can use this program. Once you have it installed, if you want to basically remove the passcode from your device, if you got a secondhand device for example, it turned out locked or your kid accidentally set up a passcode and you don't remember it and they don't remember it and so on, you can go ahead in here on the screen passcode and you have to connect the locked device to your computer. And this works for forgot iPhone passcode and the iPhone has been locked and cannot be used again. As you probably know, if you try to input a wrong password a couple of times, it will lock the device. And at some point it will just say connect to iTunes or something like that. So I'm gonna press start in here, but before we do that, you have to know that this will erase all the data on your device. So this will basically nuke everything that is stored in there photos, contacts, whatever, anything that you don't have a backup to your iCloud or to your computer will be removed. So I'm gonna go ahead and press start and um, before we do this again there is an important thing you should know that if you have find my iPhone, find my iPad or find my iPod turned on you will have to activate your device after this. This is not going to bypass the normal activation so you will still need your Apple ID and password in order to activate the device if you do have find my iPhone turned on. It says in here download the firmware package online. Now this program will essentially reinstall iOS on your device. It will download iOS from Apple and reinstall it so that you have a clean install on the device. You can select the firmware version from here. Only one is currently signed so only one is available. If you do have an IPSW for that you can press select over here but if you don't just press download. The program has already identified what kind of device you have and what firmware is the latest and works for your device so it will be downloaded automatically. So I'm gonna wait for this to complete. It may take a while depending on how fast your internet connection is. So I'm gonna be right back once this completes. Alright so at this point the download is now complete and is verifying the software. The reason it does that is to ensure that you're not restoring a firmware that will not match. Now it says firmware has been downloaded. iPod Touch 7 generation which is the latest and the latest version of iOS for this device. Those devices do not have iOS 16 but the program does work with 16 as well. So I'm gonna press start in here and that's it. It says extracting the firmware, which will take some time, it decompresses the uh, zip file. And after this is complete, your device will start restoring. iOS will be reinstalled on your device and that will also remove the passcode that you no longer remember. Unfortunately, it will also remove all the data that is not backed up. Extraction complete in here, we press unlock and that's it. It says failed to start because your device is not in recovery mode. Please put device in recovery mode. So to put the device in recovery mode, you can Google it, but uh, normally you press the power button and the volume down on newer devices and you hold them until the device reboots. Stop pressing the power button and your device should get in either DFU mode or recovery mode. As you can see this is now in DFU mode which is okay. We can press now unlock in here and the device will work. Please ensure that uh, the device is connected. It also says in here using iMyPhone lock wiper will unlock the device but it will erase all the data and we have to input that passcode over there which is 0000. So I'm gonna press unlock now and that's it. So this will reinstall basically the whole iOS version on your device. Your device may show an Apple logo and a progress bar during this process. It's normal and you may even get some reboot at this point, but just don't disconnect the device from the computer. Once this program is completed, it will essentially reboot the phone by itself and you will be able to use the device normally. All right, so at this point it says unlock is complete and we can press down here and that's it. Here I have the device connected to the computer so you can see exactly what's going on. And yes, it is right now on the setup screen. We can select the language, we can select the country and stuff like that, you will basically have to reconfigure the device completely. Alright, so we have now the option to create a new passcode, so as you can see the old one is no longer here, and we can use no passcode whatsoever, and that's it. We can just configure the device without a passcode, don't transfer anything, I don't have an account, I'm gonna select in here to not use any Apple ID, and that's it. We can agree with the terms and conditions, and we're now able to set up Siri and whatever, 
and the light mode and get started. That's it. We can now use our device no problem. Here are the voice recording application, the measure application and stuff like that. So basically everything is available in here, files and whatever. You can use your device normally just like you did before. So that's basically it. If you want the program, definitely check it out in the link below. It's iMyPhone Lock Wiper. Thank you for watching. I am Geosnow. Till the next time, subscribe to stay updated and peace out.